For those of you who have watched my video called Digital Scrapbook Artist Using Photoshop Brushes in DSA, you may have noticed that there was a way to color your brushes which you can no longer do in Digital Scrapbook Artist 2 and because that video was made using Digital Scrapbook Artist 1, I've been getting a lot of emails asking me how to change the color of a Photoshop brush in Digital Scrapbook Artist 2. So this video I'm going to show you how to do it. Basically you have your Photoshop brush on your blank page. You're going to left click on it to select it. Now you have two options. You could go over here and you could click on the FX button which is only available when you're in the effects. So you can left click on that. Or another thing you can do while your image is selected, you can just right click and then go to filter effects. Left click on it once and over here you have a little arrow. You can left click on that and you can see your brush. Now what I'm going to do is go over here to color fill and you want to make sure you're in normal. If you're not in normal you can just pull this down and move it around. You've got your colors over here so you can just pull this down and you can select any color you want and you can see your brush becomes that color. I'm just going to go back here. I'm going to select blue. Make sure that your opacity is all the way over to 100. This is your slider. You want it all the way to 100 and then all you need to do is click on OK. As soon as you click on OK, leave the image selected. Now the next part is really important. You go to the top of the screen, you click on Tools, and then Convert to Bitmap. Leave everything the way that it is. You want two check marks over here. Click on OK. Give it a second or two to convert, and depending on your computer, it may be fast, it may be slow. Now if you want to, you can easily go into your effects. You can still color fill this any color you want with your effects. Or you could just go back here, turn off your effects, and you can now color this any color you want in uh, Digital Scrapbook Artist 2. Now what you basically do is move this over here into your embellishments, get rid of your old one, and just save it as a digikit. If you have any questions, please feel free to email me. My email address is lovemyzombie at yahoo.ca.